Welcome to Dinosaurs A to Z, where we stomp through the alphabet and explore the extraordinary world of dinosaurs. I'm Dr. Victoria Edgerton, Eli Lilly & Company, Extraordinary Scientist in Residence at the Children's Museum of Indianapolis, and I'm your guide for Dinosaurs A to Z. Today, our featured dinosaur is Eutyrannus, for the letter Y. Eutyrannus was a large predatory dinosaur that lived about 125 million years ago. It belongs to a group of dinosaurs called the Tyrannosaurids. This is the same group that would give rise to Tyrannosaurus rex 60 million years later. Three skeletons were found, including a semi-articulated, almost complete skeleton, which is really rare. The largest U Tyrannus found was about 30 feet long and weighed as much as a rhino, so a little smaller than T. rex. It has been estimated that there is about an 8 year difference in age between the largest and the smallest U Tyrannus skeletons. Maybe they were a family group, or maybe they just happened upon each other at the same time. U Tyrannus means feathered tyrant. Can you guess why scientists might have named it that? because it was found covered in fossilized feathers. When it was discovered, it was the largest dinosaur ever found with feathers. Talk about a big bird. The feathers were probably more like fluffy ostrich feathers rather than feathers you would find on most bird wings today. Overall, the feathers weren't that long, only about six or seven inches. So what were the feathers used for? And does this mean Tyrannosaurus rex had feathers too? Well, those are both great questions. Perhaps U. Tyrannus's feathers were used for insulation. During the early Cretaceous, where U. Tyrannus was found, the average temperature was about 50 degrees Fahrenheit, which is pretty chilly, especially in the winter when the temperatures probably dropped below freezing. Having good insulation all year round would have made U. Tyrannus much more comfortable. Later on in the late Cretaceous, where Tyrannosaurus lived, the average temperature was a nice 64 degrees. Not too hot and not too cold on average. This means that Tyrannosaurus may not have needed feathers for insulation, as its ancestor did. By this time, if it had feathers, it probably used them in a different way, like showing off to other Tyrannosauruses. U. Tyrannus is a beautiful feathered dinosaur. There are 20 other dinosaurs that start with the letter Y. Which one will be your favorite? 